Let's travel. Hopefully something. Potentially nothing. Things look better here. Helen is working out. Banishes. Good day. You look well, Mrs. Priest. We struggle on. But yes, I feel better. How are you doing, Helen? My days are quiet. Some are better than others. At times, I am grateful for the memories. At others, they feel like fingers clamped upon my throat. I'm still learning to live around my grief. We're very sorry for your loss. As am I. What can you tell me about a young woman by the name of Grace? It seems you already know <coughs> some of the story. It was a long time ago, but I'll do my best to fill in the gaps. Apologies if that sneeze came through, guys. Tried to <laughs> mute as quick as I could. What happened to her? As I heard it told, one day Grace just wasn't there anymore. How was their relationship? I believe it was stormy. As you'd expect between a commander and his disobedient daughter. I do think he loved her. But as far as anyone ever saw, he never shed a single tear for her. Later, after he exiled her, did the captain try to find his daughter? Not to my knowledge. He did not set off in search of her, nor did he send men. At the time, I thought it strange. Still do. I'll never understand how a man could reject his only daughter. And that, my inquisitive banisher friends, is all I know about the matter. By any chance, might you have anything useful in your inventory to sell? Have a look and decide for yourself. Take care of yourself, Helen. I will. No one else seems to want to. Yes. We do. Grace was right in front of us all along. I barely recognize her. Let's find her. Lammy should be able to help us with the ritual. Arrows. No governor, no meeting house, and it seems no faith. Best on. What can I do for you? We found a page ripped from a book. Yeah, do you recognize it? Let me see. Is this from the Trismegistus riddles? <laughs> yes, it seems to be. Why would you bring me one mildewed page from an amusing but harmless little book? Why would you fail to disclose that you'd given another ritual?
to another friend. It was a long time ago. I said after Caleb I'd distribute no more rituals, and that's what I've done. Uh, uh, not done. We know. But we're looking for Grace Pennington now, and we were hoping you'd help us find her. Who? Really, boy? Oh, I'm sorry. Mistress Antea, you said Grace's name, and it is my reflex to protect her. Ever heard of someone named Seeker? Seeker? No. Sounds like a title, like my true pursuer. This Seeker... Is she... Grace? Is she alive? Do you know where she is? We think she's Grace. We hope she's still alive. We're trying to find her. We think she's hidden herself away behind your dissimulation spell. Uh, then you'll need to unravel it. Shouldn't be too difficult once you're armed with this salient fact. When was the last time you saw Grace Pennington? It had to be a few days after I brought her the cloaking ritual. When I returned to visit, the hut had disappeared. Which makes sense now that I think of it. That's it? You never again tried to find your best friend, your only friend. Well, you see, some weeks later, the first whispers of witchcraft started to fly about town. I kept my head down, and Grace was better off out of it. I was right. And I'm glad she escaped. Strange to think of her again after so long. How does the ritual work? It creates illusions so effective that they deceive even the keenest eye. There are more effective cloaking spells, but the Trismegistus riddles do have a simple elegance. The short version, please. Ending with how we break it. Uh, yes, yes, uh, of course. To achieve that, all you need is the caster's full name and the symbol used to make fast the illusion. Grace Pennington and a triangle pointing downwards. Well then, now all you need is a simple counterspell from the same book and... Oh, my. What now? I'm afraid I left my copy in the Araloo. Uh, in the void. That's just great. Just great. Yes, but in my defence, once you've retrieved the book, dispelling Grace's illusion will be like a walk in the park, comparatively speaking. Thank, Thank you for your help. Could you tell Grace that I'm still her friend? I'd be glad to see her again. Once we found her, we'll be glad to tell her. Yeah. Some could say I've been trying to avoid. Where is the void? Where are we going? Come on then. Talk to me. Don't hold back. You act as though all is well. As though I had not died. I'm dead. And I'm not alright. I'm not alright at all. But you pretend not to see it. That makes me angry. And it makes me sad. I never wanted that. I know. But it still felt that way. Extra wet. Really hate. 
How do you everything? These stains block the way through, like a thick web. That's what that was. Still no ghostly spectral spiders hiding away in there, no? Good. More corrupted ivy waiting to be plucked uh. out. Fuck me. Actually, hate. Easy game design. Teamwork. Ate it. I never found any more um of the purple. Maybe the warden was that the one in the arrow. Look, I couldn't talk about it. Couldn't talk about what? You accused me of pretending not to see that you're dead. That's how I feel, Red. You have to accept it. I just... I couldn't face your death. I admit that. Your death... left me desolate. I knew in my heart that it should have been me. Then you came back. I snatched at the chance to undo what had been done. Don't wish to deny your pain. No. I've just tried to deal with mine. Wow. That's... I hadn't thought of it that way. Thank you for your honesty. Ow. Oh, no debuffs and... Watch your faces. What it is. Fucking game on it. Fucking just regular tactics in.
Oh, come on, mate. They brought more friends. Ooh. Standing by. Our book isn't here. Our book might be up there. I might need some help. I might be able to give it. John? Again. Yeah, right next to me. <laughs> and the genius. I know no bound. Ah. This looks like Lani's stuff. Only more scattered. Even with the void shifting, the book should be around here somewhere. Abilities. Got it. That seemed a little too easy. We have the symbol we need. Let's go back to the mountain and find her hiding place. <laughs> Did you hear that? First things first, Red. Boarding. Oh, good. You are in this. Great! More fun. Or not. A little bit of Get out of there. We'll get back up. I can win your spectral, baby. I can shoot you. You some hard times, baby. It's stronger now. Brace yourself. I didn't you, bro. Oh, you died. For me to get my Scottish ass out of here. I'm glad that these two are saying the patch thing. Because the snarkiness was really annoying. Like really annoying. Oh, 
right now. Down there. Don't watch this from navigation skill. Ah, oh, the snow. Can't say I love it more than the other places because I think they're all equally well designed. I haven't done it. I don't know if I did all the one. Back. Coming. Yep, there he is. So it seems like we're pushing for the end now, guys. What's been your favorite, like, haunting, if you can remember, or, you know, just points of the game that's really stood out to you? And would you like to see a sequel or follow-up or different banishes? I right, keep the same thing going, but banishes with different skills, different story, different area. But ideally, like, I know where in America, all the things, this is America. Ideally, I'd like to see something like this back in England, somewhere in Europe, Africa, different regions. The fault. Like, if it's optimized a bit better on PC, running this on a, <laughs> a computer that's definitely not, um, you know, with, with video card and all that stuff, chunking it out. Stunning. I mean, it looks fine at the minute on bloody PS5. I think it's in performance mode. I can't remember if it has different set. But if it is, I'd have it in performance mode. Anyway, that phase by graphics. Um, especially on console. But yeah, if you can... The option to have both on PC. Hang on that. Here we try. He's sticking his head around the bloody corner. Incoming. For help if you need it. I will. Worry about me. Ah. Uh, a great deal. As the wisp activated by they just don't do anything wait all the way back to this Better my cat, we can go ups. <coughs> Bloody hell. He's in a coffin. Hopefully I'm not becoming um
going? to me idiot This is it. Seeker is behind this wall. Let the veil of unknowing be lifted. Let us see through the eyes of Grace Pennington. Ceridian? You're surprisingly slow, even for a banisher. You're late. Or early. At last we find you. Missed me that much, did you? You could have hurried. You always think you have more time, and suddenly you don't. It wasn't in vain. We have come far and learned much. I hope so. I don't think you have it all figured out. You still banish us, after all. We are indeed, Grace. So, you know. When I asked if you'd known Deborah Comenius, you denied it. Why? Seeker never met Deborah. Grace did. I am no longer Grace, and I don't like to speak for her. Deborah was Grace's teacher. She encouraged her to be herself, to become who I am now. They did not know one another, but without Deborah, I'd have never met Ceridian. And with Ceridian, my entire life changed. Deborah suffered terribly, and the fate she met was exactly the fate I fled. I accept it now. I accept it all. Ceridian has left a hollow, and I am called to fill it. I accept. I am ready for my role in this world. Are you ready for yours? We looked for you everywhere. Why did you leave the Maya marshes? I needed time. Silence. We own space. Hidden away behind Lamy Haskell's dissimulation spell. Oh. You know about that. It held a full seven years. Isn't that impressive? This is the place where I embrace solitude. This is where I made it a strength. Did Ceridian find you here? Not physically. I dreamed of her. I dreamed of the Maya marshes. So, I went there. And I found the island. Quite the thing. Meet your dream in person. I suppose so. At the time, I was more focused on the fun I'd had getting to the island. Oh, so? Our first dance. I admit I ran away. But we have danced many times since then. Old Mossad, Ceridian and me. You learned magic by yourself? Not really. Not at all. First, Lammy Haskell's forbidden books told me that magic was real. They say you must look out for the quiet kids. And that was me and Lammy. 
Reading those books opened my eyes to worlds of wonder. But I did not learn witchcraft until Ceridian found me. Lammy showed me the view from the prison window, but my mistress walked me right out the door. Lammy was relieved to hear you're well. He talked about paying you a visit. When I was exiled, he was the only one who'd help. Sweet boy. But now is not the time for visitors. Later, perhaps. Later, when you have lifted the curse. The boy will be disappointed. He has a thing for witchery. The time has come for us to go back to New Eden and face the nightmare. Yes. Balance must be restored. You must face your fate and end the curse. Ceridian said the only way back was through the void. But the pond seems broken. We need your help. Of course you do. We're listening. Remember Ceridian's words. If you were to defeat the nightmare, your hearts must be open to each other. No barriers. Your bond must be strong. We've never been stronger. This void breach is not like the others. This one... leaks. This one sits at the rotten core of the entire region. You must leave whatever still burns in your hearts at the threshold. If you don't, the Void will kill you. Do you know where in New Eden Town the Void shall lead us? The trick is to focus on your happiest memories and let them take you there. At least that's how it's always worked for me. We'll try. And when at last you succeed, I too shall return to New Eden Town. I shall see you there. It would be good. Oh, this cool. that, we'll take our leave. Bring peace to this troubled land and your troubled hearts, my friends. I know it's not easy to hear, especially when it's me saying it. On the contrary. Thank you, Seeker. We'll do our best. Okay, guys. Look at this chest. Next push is off to New Eden. Alright guys, I'll see you in the next part. We'll push through. Appreciate your being here. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you can. Get on the system shock again soon too, but we're nearly there, guys. Easy. Thanks. Appreciate you.